Hello, hello, and welcome back to the introduction video of my new BMW Z4. Um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you've probably seen it over the past couple of months. Uh, I got the car in May, and I sold my one series last week, so this is kind of just my first chance of getting to show you guys Z4. So it's going to be a quick introduction kind of video, we'll probably do a full review at some point. I'm just testing out some new camera equipment, I've got a new microphone on today. I'm getting eaten alive by midges because it's wet and dusk sunset. Um, lovely Scottish weather for getting bit and I might get run over because I'm on a main road. So without further ado, let's continue with the Z4. This Z4 is a 2005 E85 2.5i. The unfacelifted ones all came as SE trim, so you just really get the chance to upgrade your alloys and the different extras like paint and parking sensors, things like that. When I first got the car, the wheels are a bit of a disaster, so I've had them redone, along with new rondelles in the centre here, so they look a bit more sharp. On the side here we've got the 2.5i badge. I love these rondelles for the indicator, I think that's a nice wee touch. As we move around to the back of the car, kind of nice simple lines. Dual exhaust tips on the left, because this is a six cylinder model, which is I think about 190 horsepower this car has from the factory. Um, probably lost a few since then, but it was serviced last month, so we'd like to think it's still maintaining about 180 at least. Have a quick step inside the car. So being a Z4 it does get a slightly different interior to the other BMWs from this generation. So this is like the Chris Bangle design era. With no clunky iDrive or anything in this one, that is an option to get the screen. Um, this one doesn't have it, which I think is a little bit of my preference, because you get the smooth kind of flat top dashboard there without the kind of bulky thing that pops up. Um, I also seen in Parker's vehicle versions the Rolls Royce Silver Seraph, his 2000 model, had a similar kind of wee screen that popped up when accelerated and braked. I'm not sure if you guys seen that. It looks like a very similar kind of dated unit from BMW. So yeah, nice simple design, kind of an aluminium brush tier, simple radio, good sound system. Um, being open top cruiser. I said we'll do a fuel review at some point, but just kind of wanted to show you guys my car, um, which is quite nice for Scottish summers, is the heated seats. And that's about it, I've got a nice sports steering wheel, which I think is quite funky looking, with the kind of silver spoke trim, leather wrapped. Um, and one thing straight away from watching it's Joel and Ben Ray's videos, uh, no cup holders on the Z4, just an option that wasn't added to this car. But as I said, I just wanted to show you guys kind of an introduction to my car. Uh, hopefully you guys like it, give it a thumbs up. Um, please subscribe to the channel below as I'm trying to get as many videos as I can out to you guys. Aiming for at least once a week. Uh, it could be twice a week just depending on how my week's going. So thanks for all your support and hopefully the new camera gear works. <laughs> so yeah, get, smash that like button, subscribe below and I'll see you next video. Thanks very much for watching. Ciao!